afternoon and evening, everyone. This is Tessa Spade today. It is Sunday, April 28th, 2024, and it is day 119. Dang it, Bobby. Look at that. I got it without any real problems, though, technically. This is day two because I had a, per I had a mouth on thing with this avatar. I am to redo something. Are my nails black? Why are my nails black? Hang on. There we go, that's better. I think. Does that look better? You no, know what? Hang on. Yeah, I'll keep it right there. Leave it on yellow, but really they're, they're pink. Unfortunately, this is one of those worlds where no matter what I do, this, uh, the, the hair's just gonna glow. I mean, I can try to move it around somewhere where it's not so bright and see what happens. Uh, no, there's lighting everywhere here. Whatever, well, can't really do anything about it, but anyway, I'm just gonna scan over here where it looks really pretty. It is pretty over here. <laughs> well, outside of that, Louie is having a blast right now. Um, she's been looking at very, very inappropriate Boo Hill TikToks. And by Boo Hill, we're talking about the cyborg from Hokai Star Rail. And, uh,. <laughs> I only recently learned from her mentioning it to me that apparently someone uh, hacked into a cybernetics and I guess you could say they installed the equivalent of a weed stick in his brain so wherever he tries to curse it forces him to say something else like fudge and maybe I don't know what ruckers maybe I don't know that that that's a oh, that's a franchise can't say that one well yeah apparently he said he, he's forced to censor himself so that should be interesting I was thinking about the kind of things that he can say once he's saved from that beach ship kind of thing but then again I can't really I can't really say any of it we're also while well, we're on the no drinking challenge we're on the no cursing challenge too and I am not going to slip up and curse. I will not slip up. Mm -mm. No slip. Of course, my finger wants to be annoying. There is a whole lot of thumping going on in the living room right now, and I don't know why. I'm pretty sure it's sweet tea, but yeah, I, I tried to get Lily to be uh talking about other things, but she's very, very one-track mind on this Boo Hill shenanigans right now. I guess I can understand that, because uh, robots and cyborgs and stuff, she's into that kind of thing. She really likes those. Don't ask me why. I... I only know so much about it. Well, I, I do. But it's also none of my business to talk about it. Ugh. Aside from that, um, Lily and I were, we were gonna do some VR together last night, and that could not happen, because we had major thunderstorms here. In fact, uh, there were some tornadoes in parts of Oklahoma, but not here. We got lucky and barely missed us, but I think it hit my friend in, in uh, the city he's in. I'm not 100% sure there. I'm pretty sure he's alright, though. I'll check on him. Um... But yeah, mo mo most of the people who um, got hurt from the tornadoes last night and this morning were in rural, 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 yeah. okay, rural areas of Oklahoma. My lenses are also fogging up again, sorry. But there was that. The sunrise stones were absolutely stunning, especially the ones later at night rather than the earlier in the evening ones. Those ones were kind of lackluster. But man, we had we had some very, very um energetic other storms. Like some of the some of the lightning bolts were flickering in the same spot, in the same general uh art path for like six seconds, which is really unusual, but boy, howdy, it was pretty. I, I recorded what I could of it, but unfortunately it didn't want to be all spectacular where I, where and when I was recording. It waited until I was in bed. It waited until I was in bed to be pretty er. Eh, you'll figure with that, though. Fine. 
I, uh, they're wandering. I had to go somewhere. I did nice. Thing is, it's not a really big world. In fact, it's relatively small, as you can tell. But it's fun enough. It's it's pretty. That's why I came here. It's pretty. But I was gonna go to a park, but I don't exactly have park where do I? And I all am I already worse? Um. I a kind of casual wear and the um the ASMR world. Yeah, that's it. Yes, yes, by the way, we did I did take Lily over to that ASMR world that same time. Uh, was it that night? I don't remember if it was that night. Uh yeah, I think it was. I had two nights ten, 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 two nights ago, I think. I, I I did get to take Lily there. She absolutely she absolutely loved that world. So, the, uh, the ear pick. We do not like the ear pick. It's a very uncomfortable feeling. Oh, it is, uh, very, very warm in here. From all those storms, it is unbelievably humid right now. Oh, the humidity is awful. It is awful. I, just wearing the headset, I've been beef bobbing for like 30 minutes and it's still fogging up. In fact, I'm gonna try again. Hang on. This is what it looks like when you fall your lenses. Well, wipe your lenses down. <laughs> it looks like you just... It looks like you get up rapidly with the most horrible, horrible mosquito bite on your forehead. You know what I mean? It's just how... Anyway... Anyway... Oh man, everything's a little bit blurry at the moment. See if I can fix that. Nope. Um, about right there. Yeah, that, that's better. Things look a lot better already. Kind of. Let's see. Uh, I'm just uh, fixing the IPD. There we go. 65. This should should be enough, I think. But my eyes are very quick to lose focus. It, it, that's, that's a me problem, really. Ugh. I don't really have a whole lot I can talk about. I thought I did. I did, I did it uh, because uh, Buttercup has a sore throat right now. Don't worry, I checked. I don't see any signs of where I need to take her to the doctor or anything. So it doesn't look like she has strep throat. I think she just has a sore throat. Um... I, I, uh... Because of the sore throat, I went and got her some ice cream. I'm not Neapolitan. I'm personally not really that big on Neapolitan ice cream. I like vanilla. I like vanilla ice cream because of its versatility, but I wasn't thinking about me. I was thinking about the kids. So they got some Neapolitan ice cream. They're happy. They're comfortable. And I made myself some sparkling water, which I will have a little bit of right now. Come here. That is the sound of... Sparkling water opening up with voice mod running. Ah. Just plain old sparkling water, nothing else spectacular about it. It's just water and carbonation. I love it. I couldn't I couldn't do my carbonated tea. Cause we had to make more, so it's out on the uh, patio getting some sunlight in so we can have some some tea later. Yes, we do sun tea. I don't know why, but I, I do think the British people, they need to try sun tea where you just get a jug of cold water that can clear jug of cold water. Put, in, put one gallon's worth of tea packets or a one gallon tea packet in there and let it steep in the sun for, for a couple hours. You will love it. It's delicious. Um, yeah, for some, yeah, for some reason, the British, they're like, you do that? What's wrong with you? Oh, yeah, this is the face. You do that, you don't drink your tea hot. Well, I drink my tea hot sometimes, but sometimes I like some nice cold sun tea. It's really good. You should try it. Uh, well, I really do wish there was more I could talk about, but I'm 
I'm, 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 I'm a little bit at a loss because it's... My mind is really, really set on what's going down tomorrow. But what can you do? You're, you're hit with something like that and... Uh, really, if I had been, if I had still been drinking, or if, if we, if, if we had still been drinkers, like heavy drinkers, Tara and I would probably have had an aneurysm over that notice. So I'd say that is definitely a step in the right direction. <laughs> we're, we're not utterly freaking out and unable to think clearly on what our next steps are. We have a, we have a plan. And, um, Right now, we're confident. Right now, at least. Ugh. I just want to double check what this world is called, you know? Hang on. What is this world called? It's just called Drip in Space. Okay. But, um, yeah, I mean, I, I am annoyed with the last two videos that Tara and I put up because we made sure that it was freeware music that was actually. I just went into a, a world, and apparently I couldn't hear, but the computer did hear, hear that there was audio in that world, and gave us a copy a, a, a copyright. And then Tara yesterday tried to use freeware music for the for his video, and he got a copyright there too because someone apparently snuck in copyrighted music. Gotta love that. I sometimes wonder if people do that intentionally. So it's like, oh, you have some free rare music. I'll go ahead and use this. <laughs> that joke's on you. It's not. So, uh, yeah, we're just gonna have to stick with what YouTube has to offer. And unfortunately, when it comes to, um, film music, or, you know, like lo-fi and everything like that, YouTube doesn't have that. They have very... They have dorky stuff. It's not, it's not really all that. I mean, don't, don't get me wrong. I do like jazz. Jazz is nice, but it's jazz, R&B, or silly. <laughs> and we're not putting lyrics in any of this stuff because that would defeat the purpose of what we're doing anyway. What? You know, if you think about it, why do they have freeware music on YouTube that have lyrics? I haven't heard anyone use it. And if you do, I'm so, so sorry. Because the lyrics are just, they're just terrible. I'm gonna criticize it. The lyrics are terrible. And people need the free, want the three wear song. You tell so they have some background ambiance. Yeah, I did go for some back. You know what? I need, I need to find some way to get. Uh, maybe I'll just have to. I'll, I'll talk to my friend. I'll, I'll talk to my friend. He's a music producer. So maybe he can come up with something kind of spacey and nice. But uh, really, it's Tara's going to have to do it. He's weirded out right now. <laughs> yeah, I've been weirding people out lately. But that's okay. It's me. I don't care. And, and I never really see them anyway. So what's the, what's the big deal? I don't really see anyone from my earlier life. I only see Lily and Buttercup and Sweet Pea, and sometimes Lily as parrots. I don't really see anyone else. You know, IRL. Well, what? I guess I, I guess we could include that we do know the people that work over at like Dollar General and CVS, but outside of that, no, not really. And that's just me. Anyway, uh, because, because I think I have rambled enough. Sorry. Wait, why am I sorry? Oh, probably because I rambled on things that were completely unnecessary just out there. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get going, because I'm... <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be completely honest. We have been playing too much PSO2 with NGS again. And uh, right now they have an event uh, that has a 150% uh, rare drop rate on stuff. So yeah, we have been trying to get some stuff to drop in there. Hasn't been going all that well, but it's better than not. So we're gonna go do that. After we start prepping to make dinner, cause Lily gets her prep. It's Swam Bay. Don't forget, it is Swam Bay. So Lily and, and maybe Buttercup, uh, depending on how we're us feeling, they get to have their prep. And I think, I think I'm just going to have something completely different, which is perfectly fine. I'm not feeling all shrimpy. I just had shrimp, uh, two nights ago. 
Yes, I had I had shrimp two nights ago, so I'd, I'd like to not have shrimp. I don't do shrimp all that often, personally. Lily does. So, see, it's her swam day. Buttercup gets a swam day. I'm gonna have some mouse. I'm gonna have plenty of carbonated water, because I love it. And we will see you... Well, I will see you with Tara on Tuesday. And you will see Tara tomorrow on Monday. So you get Tara tomorrow, you get us on Tuesday, and we, we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna be completely honest. The way the Tara and I together thing is difficult, but it's fun enough. It, and it's kind of fun to experiment with uh, radiography techniques. But it is still challenging to do alone. If you know what I mean. If you know, you know. Fair enough. Okay. For those who are tuning in, Tara and I are technically the same person. Very obvious on that if you really pay attention. So if you see us both on screen at the same time, it's challenging, but it's fun to try pulling off. In fact, if others who watch enjoy um, making the art chat videos, um, use green screen. Use green screen and a little bit of uh, self-direction. Some green screen self-direction and then when editing, you edit it, it together with keying. It's exactly quite a bit of fun. And, uh, yeah, it does take a lot of uh, coordination between yourself, really. But it, it's still fun. So I, I, I am having a lot of fun experimenting, but I do need to get going. I've rambled enough. So I'm going to let all of you go. Please enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And I'll see you Tuesday. And you can say hello to Tara tomorrow. Bye, everyone. Enjoy your Sunday.